All right, good morning, everyone. I'm at my uh, breakfast place uh, at uh, World Bakery, and I got two new phones. Uh, oh, it just locked. Uh, I got two new phones. I'll unlock that one in a second, uh, off camera. <laughs> uh, they're both Google Pixel 7As. I'm gonna be using these for the uh, Cannonball Run uh, trip to have data. One of them is on Google Fi. This is Google Fi. This is Verizon. And I'm doing speed tests to see who's got better coverage. Uh, and when Verizon drops out, I want to see if the Google Fi has uh, good connectivity. Anyway, I just did a speed test on Verizon. And look at that crazy speed. 1793 and 196. I'm going to do it again live. That's insanity. I'm trying to get the glare out of the picture here. I'm recording this on my other phone. Look at it, it just goes off the charts. And that's on Verizon 5G ultra wide right now. That is insane. That is insane. 1.8 gigabits down? What the? And over 190 megabits up, that's insanity. Okay, so here are the results from the last one. I'm trying to get those glares out of there. So 245.42 is what I got on the last test. Go. I mean, I'm still showing this one side by side. This is happening at the same time side by side. Look at the difference. So Verizon is always just awesome when you've got coverage. Look at that. I need to get cases for these phones. They're coming in today. So look at that. I'm trying to hold the camera still. I apologize. I'm recording this with my other phone. That's insane, the difference. So I'm going to reset both of them. That way they track new towers, and I'll try this again. But that's, that's just staggeringly impressive. 1812-193 versus 244-39-8. Crazy. Okay, after a fresh restart, uh, let's kick them off again. Go and go. <laughs> Side by side. We'll have a duel. Now I just did the test on my uh, Galaxy that I'm recording with and I got similar results on the Verizon 5G. Now strangely the Verizon is slower right now but you know, it could be network related. But it's still coming in much faster than the Google Fi. So I got 430, 183 that time. So it's still, this one is still double that. That's crazy. Let's go back here. We're gonna do test again, test again. Let's give it the best out of three or four runs. What have we got here? Oh, oh, there goes Verizon just jacking up through the ceiling. Look at that. It goes off the chart. Crazy. So Verizon is still the winner. It's insane, man. Look at that. Verizon is whooping it, man. Over 160, 170 up. That's insane. Sweet. Okay, so my buddy just arrived for uh, breakfast here. We're getting ready to eat. And uh, he's got two different phones, both of them on T-Mobile. He's got an A32 5G and an A53 5G Galaxy. Uh, so what we're gonna do, oh, don't go to sleep yet. What we're going to do is switch over here to uh, speed test and see what uh, T-Mobile's network looks like in the same place at the same time. So here we go. Go and go. <laughs> That's not going to be fair because they're both tying up the same bandwidth at the same time, but we'll see. Oh, one phone is definitely kicking faster. I'm trying to hold the camera still, guys. Sorry, this is not professional uh, video production here. 145 and the other one is getting 675. I'm gonna give the uh, the one on the left another chance after this is done. Yeah, drastic speed difference between the two phones. That's interesting. So this one's the clear winner at 676 by 57. Let's do this one again. Let's see if it's happier now without the contention right next to it. Nowhere near as fast. All right, everybody. So I just came like 
three miles, not even three miles, two miles uh, away from the breakfast place over to a client site. And I'm doing the test again. Oops, they're going to sleep. Don't go to sleep. Look how bad it is just a couple miles away. This is the same one. This is the Verizon. This is the Google Fi. So I went from 1.7 gigabit down to 13.9 by 6. 10.7 by 2 on the Google Fi. So location, location, location.